right, everybody. Well, today my husband and I are at Bubble Beach. Bubble Beach. And I'm going to go ahead and turn the camera around for you. I'm just going to show you a little bit of the entryway here. And essentially, this is kind of like a little beach club and they have a nice restaurant here and a swimming pool. So we're going to enjoy ourselves. We have a beautiful view of this side of the island, which is more of the northwestern side of Koh Samui. So nice to have Dave back with me. I feel like I'm complete. You complete me, Dave. I think I heard that in the movie. <laughs> so it seems like they have a good selection of food items here. And we usually order pizza wherever we go just to try it out because we love pizza. And there is no pizza on this menu. But I'm going to go ahead and include some of the pictures of the menu up here in the corner for you so you can take a peek and see what they do offer here um, at Bubble Beach. So it definitely is a simple little place, um, but I'm excited to try their food. We ordered a fried papaya salad, and we also ordered their onion rings to start, so we'll see how it is. Um, but no entry fee, you just come in, you can enjoy the pool, look at this beautiful ocean view here, um, and just buy something to eat, and you're good to go. Okay, Dave's gonna try the onion rings. Now, disclaimer. Kim's already tried one and said they were great. They are really good. Oh yeah. Yummy, huh? So, we would highly recommend the onions. Yeah, absolutely. That is a fried papaya salad right there. And that looks fantastic. Look at all the fixins. And Dave and I, we're gonna dive into that. We're getting it ready. What'd you think, Dave? Just look at the plate. Kinda says it all, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was so good. So I think one of the tricks with that the fried papaya salad is you take the fixings and you put it on top, you mix it all together, kind of chop it up and stuff, and mix it all together and then eat it that way. And the juice is just mixed in with the fried papaya salad. And it's like juicy, but it's crispy and it's sweet and it's spicy at the same time. So good, you gotta try it. So I think this uh, section of the beach here on the northwestern side of the island where we're located here at Bobo Beach um, is called Bampo. I wanna say that's the way he pronounced it. 
but I'll look into that and hopefully be able to post the name of that up here in the video for you. Um, but this is a beautiful area of Koh Samui. Um, I think a lot of people kind of get wrapped up into the Lamai and Chuang area and they don't quite realize how gorgeous the other side of the island can be. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the camera around for you. You can see some more of the sections of the beach here. And of course you can see the island of, I think that's Copenhagen. Uh, so off in the distance there, you should be able to clearly see a Thong Ravine Park. And you can see the sky. It got really dark behind the restaurant. And that cloud has missed us. So it looked like we were going to get some rain. But uh, it's blown further on down, heading south here. And there looks to be somebody walking on this beach. Not a lot of people out walking this beach today. Who could this be? It could only be the one and only Mr. David Dion. So that storm cloud that was behind the island or behind us before has worked its way on down. And it seems to be just pouring, just pouring buckets over there pretty cool. You can see the cutoff where the rain is and where the skies are clear. Super cool. Okay, so we have concluded our day here at Bobo Beach. I have gone with entirely too much sun. Of course, we're driving the little MG Yellow Beast, which I just uh, renewed our lease on for another, another uh, like five months or so. But the weather has held today and it was a perfect day with another perfect, fantastic lunch. So we'll catch you all soon.